हेलो फ्रेंड्स हाउ यू ऑल माय नेम इज हर्षित द्विवेदी फ्रेंड्स एंड आई वेलकम यू बैक टू माय वीडियो सो इन दिस वीडियो फ्रेंड्स आई विल बी डिस्कसिंग विद यू अबाउट लैटिट्यूड्स एंड लॉन्गिट्यूड्स नाउ फ्रेंड्स आई एम स्टार्टिंग विद माय ज्योग्राफी सीरीज फॉर अ लॉन्ग अमाउंट ऑफ टाइम मेनी पीपल वर डिवाइडिंग टू अपलोड ज्योग्राफी लेक्चर्स सो आई विल स्टार्ट अपलोडिंग ज्योग्राफी लेक्चर्स फ्रॉम द वेरी बेसिक आई विल स्टार्ट फ्रॉम वेरी बेसिक देन आई विल मूव ऑन टू अ मीडियम डिफिकल्टी लेवल एंड देन वी विल कम आउट टू द वेरी हाई लेवल कॉन्सेप्ट सो स्लोली स्लोली वी विल इंक्रीज अवर लेवल फ्रेंड सो दिस इज अ वेरी फर्स्ट वीडियो द वेरी बेसिक थिंग इन द जोग्राफी दैट वी विल डिस्कस इज लैटिट्यूड्स एंड लॉन्गिट्यूड्स एवरीथिंग अबाउट दैन विल बी डिस्कस बाई मी फ्रेंड्स सो दिस इज प्रेजेंटेड बाई मी If you want to follow me, friends, you can follow me on my Instagram profile, which is given in the description box below. Also, friends, this video is in English. The Hindi version of the video is already uploaded on my channel. So, if you want to watch the Hindi version of the video, you can also go and watch it. So, see, friends, this figure shows the latitude, and this one shows the longitude. Now, equator. We all have heard at some point of our life about equator. Now, equator is a line. which crosses all around the earth at just the center and it runs in the east west direction so you can see in between this red line this is the equator okay friends now this is the equator and equator is the largest latitude that you should know so equator is the largest latitude and all other latitudes running on the surface of the earth are parallel to equator and all those lines which run perpendicular to the equator and other latitudes are longitudes for example see this okay friends now there is one basic difference between latitude and longitude friends that latitude are parallel and they will never intersect with each other and longitudes intersect with each other let's move on to the definition you will get to know about this more friends i will come back to this figure after some point of time just going to the definition of this thing friends what are latitudes so latitudes are also known as parallels okay and longitudes are known as meridian on that i will come after some time so latitudes are known as parallels they are concentric circles why concentric circles see friends you can see this latitude they are going around and around this whole is covered like this then here also this whole is covered like this. so they are uh, covering the whole surface of the earth. this equator goes around the whole circumference of the earth so basically they are circles and they are parallel circles and obviously these latitudes and also the longitudes they are basically imaginary lines in real on the surface of earth there are no such line friends they are just imaginary and they have been devised by the humans for some basic calculations calculations related to locating the exact location of a many point calculating the time standard calculating calculations in climatology so every these type of things <coughs> and knowing about the temperate zone torrid zone tropical zone so all of these things are done by finding by using the reference of latitudes and longitudes so latitudes and longitudes both are imaginary lines there are no such real lines as latitudes and longitudes friends okay now coming back to this figure see this is the equator okay friends this one this is zero degree okay now when you are going to move in this direction this is the north direction and when you are going to go this direction this is the south direction so this is north latitude this is south latitude so obviously this line this is also latitude this is going whole round the earth then this line this is also latitude going all round the earth this also so obviously these lines are in the north direction of this equator and they are parallel to equator so they will become parallels and they are also known as latitude for example this one will be known as 30 degree north latitude this one 60 degree north latitude so this is how this thing goes similarly when we go into the south direction you can see this line this is also latitude then this line you it is written has 30 degree south latitude then this line 60 degree south latitude okay so these are latitude friends because they are running parallel to the equator they are running in us east west direction okay because this is east and this is <coughs> west friends okay now let's have a look at longitude friends what are longitudes so i have already talked about the latitudes this equator is also a latitudes and all those line running from north pole to the south pole 
and they are also covering the entire surface of the earth in the north south direction orientation and they are perpendicular to the equator or other latitudes they are known as longitudes friends so this line this so this will go full around circumference around that this also this will go full circumference around the earth so basically these are longitudes friends because they are parallel to the latitude they are perpendicular to the latitude okay they cut the equator at 90 degree and they are also covering the whole circumference of that and the biggest thing about them and the most uncommon thing about these longitudes with the latitudes is that latitudes are parallel they are concentric circles they will never intersect with each other whereas longitudes they intersect with each other because they join they come from north pole then go to south pole and then again come to north pole and all of the longitudes are uh, doing this so obviously all the longitudes are meeting at north pole and south pole both so obviously longitudes are not parallel they will intersect each other so this is the difference between latitudes and longitudes friends okay they are used for a lot of other purposes this is also you is you can also see that in this thing friends you can see here that this is uh, all are parallels or are parallels so these are latitudes and obviously here <laughs> this is one line then this is this is this is it's coming or, or you know crossing whole circumference of that so they become the longitude friends so this is the difference between latitudes and longitudes now see one more thing how we are going to calculate that what is the latitude of a particular point so it actually represents latitude actually represents the angle created by the line connecting the latitude and the center of that so that is this line connecting latitude and the center of that and the line this and angle of this line with the line which is connecting the equator and the center of that so the angle made in between will be the latitude if it is not clear it will just become clear in this figure see friends this is the equator and this is that center line now see if <laughs> this is the latitude we are talking about so this is going on in this manner see i have taken a point here just add this point to this center of that so this will be 45 degree so this will become 45 degree latitude similarly friends if there is something like this here okay so this is uh, say uh, suppose 70 degrees so this say suppose this is 70 degree latitude so if you are going to add this line to this place so this will be 70 degree so this is how we are going to calculate the angle of a latitude you can also see it here friends in this see this is the equator okay and if this is the reference points and this will be the latitude which is going around the earth okay and we have to find out what is the angle of this latitude so this i'm assuming as the center of the earth so i'm going to connect this point to this point and i'm going to measure this angle and whatever this angle will be will be this latitude friends <coughs> okay so this is how this thing is working the latitude thing okay how you are going to understand it this will make everything clear to you important latitude friends now see this is in between the equator as we move north this is north latitude as we move south this is south latitude so if we are going to compare with respect to equator friends this is tropic of cancer at 23 degree 26 minutes okay so if you are going to join this point to this center of the earth this will be 23 degree 26 minutes angle similarly this is arctic circle so if you are going to add this point to this center of that so this will be this angle will be 66 degree 34 minutes and this is a, these are important latitudes so zero degree equator is an important latitude this tropic of cancer at 23 degree 26 minutes is an important latitude this arctic circle at 66 degree 34 minutes is an important latitude similarly we will go when we will go in the southward direction that is this direction friends you will see that this is the equator in between this becomes the tropic of capricorn so if you are going to measure this point you have to connect it to the center and this angle will become 23 degree 26 minutes same goes for antarctic circle and this is north pole friends so this will be 90 degree this is south pole this will also become 90 degree why because when you are going to add this to center it will make an angle of 90 degree so this is how these things are happening friends and this is how you are going to exactly calculate the latitudes and you always need to remember one thing in mind five important latitude first is the equator zero degree tropic of cancer and tropic of capricorn 23 and 26 okay then arctic circle and antarctic circle 66 34 so these things you have to keep in mind friends then moving forward next we are going to talk about what we are going to talk about longitudes <coughs> now see the definition of longitudes longitudes measurement 
ऑफ लोकेशन ईस्ट और वेस्ट ऑफ द प्राइम मेरिडियन एट रॉयल ऑस्ट्रोनॉमिकल ऑब्जर्वेटरी ग्रीनविच द स्पेशली डेजिग्नेटेड इमेजनरी नॉर्थ साउथ लाइन दैट पास थ्रू बोथ जोग्राफिकल फोर्स एंड ग्रीनविच लैंडर सी आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन दिस थिंग यू फ्रेंड्स वॉट एपन फ्रेंड्स वेन इन एटीन हंड्रेड एंड एटी फोर इंटरनेशनल मेरिडियन कॉन्फ्रेंस टू प्लेस एंड इन दैट इंटरनेशनल मेरिडियन कॉन्फ्रेंस इट वॉज इंपॉर्टेंट दैट अ कॉमन स्टैंडर्ड इज अडॉप्टेड विच विल बी यूज टू कैलकुलेट द टाइम ऑल ओवर द वर्ल्ड सो दैट देर कैन बी अफॉर्म सेट स्टैंडर्ड so what used to do that at that point of time when this conference was taking place in 1884 1884 that time all over the world one country was dominant and that was england friends so this conference took place in greenwich london and royal astronomical observatories was set as the standard point so that line <coughs> which is joining the north pole and the south pole passing through the greenwich astronomical observatory or you can say at royal astronomical observatory in greenwich london that will become the prime meridian <coughs> and this prime meridian will be the baseline with whose respect with whose comparison we are going to calculate the time of all the world and obviously this indian standard time is also compared in comparison to this prime meridian friends and after in some videos after i'm also going to talk you about the international date line friends that international date line is also a meridian okay or you can say meridian means longitude here so it is also a longitude friends so that passes through the bering strait and that international date line is not straight so i'm going to tell you friends that these longitudes are also imaginary and they are being drawn in order to calculate the time with a common standard and that common standard is this prime meridian okay now let's see how this thing works see here friends this is the prime meridian <clears throat> this passes through african continent <coughs> and when <coughs> in the upper side you go it also passes through europe and somewhere here is the royal astronomical observatory in london okay so this becomes the focus point now you are knowing that this earth is rotating on its own axis in this east west direction okay so if it is rotating on an some angular distance will be covered and with respect to that angular distance the time is going to change from place to place friends and this is how the time is calculated and the basic standards are set and they are set according to this position of the royal astronomical observatory that is in london so how this exact time calculation will be done that will be told by me in a separate video friends just see here this longitude arrow is shown so if this is the reference and if you are going to point that uh, find out that at this longitude what will be the time so very first thing you need to know friends that all the places on this earth which are lying on this longitude time will be same and that will be calculated with respect to this lag this much distance okay that will be calculated with respect to this much distance friends why because this meridian is this much distance away from this main standard meridian which is the prime meridian now how we are going to calculate this distance this angular distance the time difference this is a topic of a separate video friends <clears throat> okay so these are the important things about latitudes and longitudes friends okay you can also see here that these are the longitudes the longitudes are coming like this 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 friends and obviously these are imaginary lines i have already told you why they have been devised by man they have been devised by man in order to find out the exact position of a particular point on the earth for example if you are going to draw a latitude and a longitude so this intersection point can be calculated and by this international point intersection point we are going to find out the exact location of a particular person at any place also friends you know the temperate zone tropical zone torrid zone they they can also be known by the position of the latitude what is the time can be known by the position of the longitude so these are the you know uses of these latitudes and longitudes a more more detail about these things will be discussed by me in subsequent videos when we'll take in when i will be taking up more advanced topic with you in relation to these topics friends so thank you for watching this video friends have a great day goodbye